before we start this video, I just want to say it took me forever to edit. I've done some really different editing than I usually do. As you can see in the top left, that this throughout the whole video, it will show all the items I have. So of course we're doing a nothing to something video, so you'll be watching me trading up trying to get good offers all the way to a interstellar. That is the aim of this video. So as you can see on the first trade, I give him wet paint and he gives me 400 credits. This is sick. Like, in the minute after the trade, I'm going to show you how much wet paint costs. There's the 400 credits. It costs 250 to 350. We just got 400 for it. Like, that is the best deal ever. Anyway, on to the next trade. Now, on this trade, this guy wanted, wanted 120 credits for Tora. This is good, because I later on sell Tora for more than 120 credits. So we're now on 280 credits with Tora, a black market. Right, we're now on to the next guy. He wanted to give me 210 credits with a car, which is coloured, for Tora. This is what I mean. Trading up is so easy. So, of course we take the trade, seeing as we only paid 120 credits, meaning we made a good profit of 90 credits and a car. That was sick. So, here we are getting the 210 credits and car. So, now we've got a grey car and 490 credits in our bank. Yep, here it is, Tora worth 150 to 250. Pretty darn good we did. So, now on this trade, this guy wanted 400 credits for this item it's another black market it's meteor strike and we got it for 400 credits that's pretty good because as you will see when this trade is done it is worth more than that oh meteor storm i mean it is worth 500 to 600 credits and we got it for 400 so that's another profit we're going to make we then sell it for 430 credits and two non-crate very rare items. And they're worth about 30 each. That's 60 credits. So we sold this for 490 credits, basically. Which means we made a 90 credit profit just from that. That is sick. So let's do this trade. I kept trying to get more out of him. This is the thing. When you do a trade, try to get more out of him. Originally, it was just the meteor strike and 430 credits i managed to get two non-crate very rares out of him and then i managed to get another very rare but it wasn't non-crate so we're doing pretty well at this point after this trade let's see what we got the guy then tries to put limiteds on however i never take limiteds as they're not really worth anything so i straight away say no to that trade and he gets rid of them and puts on the extra very rare non-crate of course it's not a non-crate though so we got the extra very rare, which means we probably made about 500 credits here. So 500 credits for Meteor Storm. Let's see how much Meteor Storm is actually worth after this trade. So here we are, we now have 520 credits, a grey car, some spiralist wheels, light speed, and breakout vector. It's worth 500 to 600. We got about 500 credits for that. That's pretty good. So we made some profit there. Now on to the next trade. This guy wanted 400 credits for this item. So I straight away said yes, as it's worth 500 to 600. Which means I get it for lower than the low price. I now have 120 credits and Neuro Agitator. Unfortunately, the editing went a bit weird and Neuro Agitator is underneath the credits, but yeah, it is still there. It's worth 500 to 600, of course, so we got it for 100 less than we should have, which is pretty good. Mm -hmm. We then get on to our next trade where this guy asks for 450 for the Neuro Agitator and a non crate very rare worth 30. It's not the best trade, but I was kind of in a rush to get rid of the Neuro Agitator because no one wanted it. So we only got about 20 credits profit from this trade, but at least we got profit. So we're now on 570, and we said bye to the Neuro Agitator already. So now we have 570, the car, and wheels, and one non-crate, very rare, left. And then we get into our next trade. 
This guy wanted 250 credits for fireworks. I said yes to this because it's a pretty good deal. So I give him the credits and then do the trade. Off the trade, we'll see how much fireworks costs. Here we go, trade is complete, add fireworks, and now we have 320 credits left. Fireworks cost 300 to 400. We paid 250 credits, which is 50 less than we should have. These are the items we have left. Fireworks, the wheels, a non-crate very rare, a grey car, and 320 credits. And we started off with about 100 credits worth. So we went to 100, to about 400, to about 600 credits. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Like for part two, and by the way, the next part is very good. We get some good trades, so look out for that video. It was absolute sick. Bye.